And good evening. Fort Wayne's Legacy Task Force met for the final time tonight. The group finalized recommendations on how to spend $70 million from the city's light lease agreement with Indiana Michigan Power. News Channel 15's Don Austin was at tonight's meeting, so where do things go from here, Don? Well, Heather and Mark, the submitted ideas were lumped into four key areas. Now a final recommendation will be passed along to Mayor Tom Henry and other city officials for consideration. The Committee of 17 has been meeting all year long, trying to narrow down nearly 1,000 proposals from people in Fort Wayne. The proposals were put into categories, reduced, and then prioritized. Tonight, the group decided the money should be used in four key areas. Economic development, with a focus on research and development, downtown investment and the rivers, youth sports and activities, and the creation of a trust. Joe Dorco, a member of the task force and CEO of Lutheran Health Network, believes the community will be happy with the final recommendations. They're broad, they're broad terms. They're really difficult to argue with. Do we want a better downtown? Do we want to take better use of the rivers? Hard to argue with. The group eliminated ideas that were too focused on individual benefits. Instead, it focused on ideas that impact the entire community. We've got good cluster industries here already, uh, defense, uh, health care, health care manufacturing. Uh, I'll just build on what we have already. And when it comes to setting a portion of the money aside in a trust, Dorco and other members of the task force said they'd like to see those funds managed by people who are not politicians. Well, let's set this aside, do something special with it, and if we keep it out of the political process, um, it allows us, I think, to achieve that objective uh, easier. And there will be some minor revisions to the plan. The final recommendations will go to Mayor Henry for consideration. He and the city council will then determine what types of projects actually get funded. Don Austin, News Channel 15.